that trolls live to be nasty, but some of these comments are over the top, even for a bunch of losers who don't have lives. Yeah, some of the things they're writing about blaze and deception just makes you want to track each one of them down. And teach them a lesson? I don't know what's worse. The homophobic trolls that are spamming us, or... The deception customers who feel deceived and betrayed that Blaze wasn't completely transparent because somehow they're entitled to know every single thing about her life, whether she wants them to or not. Oh, check this one out. Deception. It's all in the name. I guess we kind of walked into that one. Well, judging from all the similar comments, I guess we did. Trolls aren't a particularly imaginative bunch, are they? No. <sighs> This is a bona fide disaster. I, I hate that any Deception customers think we would want Blaze to hide who she really is. But deception would be anything but supportive of the LGBTQ community. Yeah, uh, it goes against who we are, personally and professionally, or as a brand. I just feel so terrible for Blaze. Her mother knew the truth about her and still said those things. How much do you think that had to hurt? I can't imagine. You know, I, I talked to Blaze about being open with her fans, but she just wasn't ready. And you respected that. But let's be honest, she wasn't ready because of her mom. And if it was up to Natalia, Blaze would never be ready. Probably not. But you know what? Blaze deserved to decide if and when she wanted to come out. I remember a time when outing people was a thing. I hated it then, and I hate it now. Yeah, well, I hated every single word that came out of Natalia's mouth. But this is between Natalia and Blaze, and they deserve the space to navigate through this privately. Someone took that away from them. To be honest, I've said some things I wouldn't want recorded and broadcast to the world. Not me, I've always been thoughtful and kind. Yeah, you're a real angel. Yeah. Even as a joke, it's not believable. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> what Natalia said, though, it's, it's out there on the internet forever. And she can't take that back, even if she wanted to. Yeah, I don't know how she and Blaze move past this, you know, try to repair their relationship, if they even can. Well, we need to figure out how to turn this around. Otherwise, Natalia's comments are gonna cancel Blaze and Deception. We need to shore up the company, figure out how to turn our public image around and save our customer base. Otherwise... Otherwise, we lose everything for everyone, including us and our careers. We will do whatever we can to support Blaze. I'm sensing a but. But? With everything going on, I just think maybe... It might be a good idea to take a break from Blaze being the face of deception. Are you done? 